any type of one-on-one -on -one type interaction with other coaches in terms of other teams you've worked out with? Uh, a little bit. I mean, if you're asking questions, they'll obviously work with you. So uh, a lot of it's just going to ask questions. And uh, I mean, Coach Smart's a, a very smart guy, um, and he's, he's somebody that uh, is great to work with. And I mean, he's, he's got a lot of good things. Overall, what kind of feedback did you receive today from your workout here? Pretty good. I mean, obviously, it's very hard to uh, tell. I mean, in a one-on-one -on -one and three-on-three -three situations, it's tough to uh, be able to get a great read of how you play. But uh, I mean, I shot the ball fairly well, and um, I mean, it hopefully continue to progress and get better. What do you know about this team, the Kings? Anything? I know quite a bit. Uh, I mean, I, obviously, I played against uh, Cousins and uh, Tyreek Evans. I played against them in the McDonald's game. Um, I mean, uh, beyond that, I don't know the people very well. I've watched them play a few times, and uh, they have a lot of potential, and uh, it could be a great team going forward. Do you think that's an asset, having played on such a talented team and then integrating yourself with you know more talented players at the next level? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, if you're the, the person, you know, you go to a team where you're the only person scoring, you get all the shots, and uh, it's, it's going to be a huge transition going to the next level where uh, you're probably not going to be the man. You don't, uh, you're don't. you not going to get as many shots, and you just got to be able to do the, the role player things. you got to be able to rebound, block shots, defend your man, and uh, be able to make the open shot. So uh, it is something I've played in that system, and uh, I know what it's like to be a role player, and I'm fine with that. And um, something going forward, I think it'll help me tremendously. What do you think your ceiling is as an NBA player? I think I can continue to progress tremendously. I think uh, I've, I've got a lot of abilities that uh, I've, I've worked on it throughout college. I just never really showed just because I got double teamed very quickly. And one-on-one uh, -on -one situations, I think I can show much more. Teams obviously spend time asking you questions, but are there any questions that you ask certain teams, like say the Kings, in terms of their situation as well? Yeah, I mean, obviously you got to ask uh, how you how they see you fitting in, what um, how they, I mean, just different things of uh, the team dynamics and how the team operates, who they got, and uh, I mean, who they got in contract next year, things like that. I mean, it's uh, very simple questions that uh, could determine a lot. I know the first two years at, at North Carolina, you struggled with, with injuries and kind of got that injury prone <laughs> label, but, but what did you do to your, your final year, I guess preparing for your final year to, to um, obviously get strengthened up and, and make sure you were fully healthy? I mean, I, was, I think I was fully healthy every every year. It's just something that, you know, the freshman year, uh, if I grab the rim, I don't get hurt on that play, and I just miss the rim by an inch. And uh, sophomore year, we had an a incident that uh, made the stress fracture. And uh, so something that I don't, I never thought I was injury prone. Uh, it was just something you got to make sure you continue to play and uh, you don't worry about getting injured. It, I mean, injuries are going to happen. And, uh, freshman year, I was able to gain about 20 pounds, which I think helped me tremendously over my college career. And, uh, and then I just got to continue to progress from there. What was it like to be out there with Tyler Zeller? What did you notice about him in terms of his skill set? Uh, you know, playing in North Carolina, and I've been watching him on TV a couple games. He's a great player. And uh, for me, just to go against him, uh, it was a great one-on-one uh, -on -one battle. Uh, I had to go at him, you know, he's, he's a high rank player on, on the board. Uh, there's no way, there's no better way just to go against a, a top competitor. Was, was the majority of the workout you versus him, or were you were you also paired on the same team as well? So? Uh, yeah, for the most part, it's just me against him. Uh, I play, I did a lot of one on one guarding everybody. So uh, yeah, pretty much. What kind of feedback did you get from the coach? Coach, you know, he said I shot the ball well, uh, played great, uh, played good defense, and just need to work on my ball handling a little more. What do you know about this Kings team? Um, they're a young team, young talented team. No Tyreek played with him in Matt Dunn's All American game. No DeMarcus uh, from the same state, so uh, no, they're a talented team. If you were to get drafted here, how do you think you would fit um, the pieces that they already have? Um, I think I'd just be able to be out there and defend, make a wide open mid range jumper, and, and rebound the ball for them.